So welcome back. Now we will be creating reinforcement powers. Okay. So what you have to do is you go to select the entities, then click no okay. And then you come to box here, you pick this and click, click okay. Then you plot nodes. Then these nodes are plotted. Then go to plot controls, numbering, node numbers. Click OK. So here you can see that uh, you go to plot stain. So you can say OK. Now here what you have to do is you go to modeling. Before modeling you go to meshing, mesh tool. Uh, set here B 188 material number 2 then main bar then click OK so then we have chosen the main bar so here go to modeling create elements auto number 2 node so click this and you click this Then also here you click this and this one. Now you go to copy elements. You choose the second element the locations you can see that the node number increment is 3 so apply how many number of copies approximately we will create here 45 copies node number increment is 3 and along z axis it is minus 15 so note on that here total number of copies including the original will be 45 node number increment is 3 and then you have z offset as minus 50 then click ok so it has created here the you can go to plot elements so here the elements are plotted now you zoom it still you have to create a few elements so we have got 45 copies now you create elements two nodes so you remember these nodes it is uh, 2287 so minus 3 will be 2284 so you go to plot numbers uh, plot uh, here you can create elements through nodes that is here so exactly we don't know where it is or you can, you can use commands if you want e comma uh, 2284 comma 2287 it is created then go to e comma 2287 comma 2290 so 45 copies we created including origin 44 45 46 then you go to e comma 2290 comma 2293 so it will create another element then go to e comma 2293 comma 823 so we have created these elements so similarly here it is 2289 minus 3 will be 2286 so give 2286 comma 2289 is created now e comma 2289 comma 2292 then go to e comma 2292 comma 2295 then go to element 2295 comma 
809. So we have created all the elements. This is the main bar. It has been created in here. Then you click fit view. Then you click save database. You select everything, plot elements. So, like this, you are getting go to plot controls numbering. You switch off the node numbers, click OK. So, here you can see that we have created the reinforcement main board. Now, we will create hanger board. So, front view you have to go, then you zoom it, then select entities. So nodes you are selecting, click OK, then you click box, choose these nodes, click OK. Now plot nodes, then you go to uh, isometric view and fit view. So then you go to plot controls, numbering, node numbers you click, then OK. Now you can zoom this here. Now you can also see that uh, from the second node, there is a node number increment of 3. So here, you go to um, mesh tool, we have to choose the hanger boss. So beam element we are using and click here, hanger boss, click OK. Then you have to close this. Now go to modeling, create elements through nodes. So we click this, apply, then click this, then click this, apply, this one, apply. So similarly, we have to here copy the elements. Then you go to copy elements auto number so you can see that 67 plus 3 is 70 70 plus 3 is 73 here you can see that 69 plus 3 72 72 plus uh, 3 75 so you can choose these elements for copying and click ok then we created 45 copies um, so here if you want you can choose uh, 48 copies including the original yeah so 48 copies node number increment 3 and z of this line so it has created the plot elements here now go to the end portion here this element cannot be created by copy command why because the node number increment is not 3 so you create Elements through nodes. Auto number through nodes. So click this one and you click this one. Okay. So you can select everything and plot. So everything is plotted here. Uh, this is the end of second video.